all right so what is going on today youtube today we're going to be playing some fire kings and hold on one real quick second and already here we go starting off playing some fire kings by Dwayne mcfadden cannot activate that card so we're going to just have to set this i believe we can't do anything now this is probably yeah i think this is my first time actually playing fire kings so if I, oh shit well it looks like it looks like we're going to be in a little bit of trouble matthias i believe we played him before so while he does this while he beats in my face um okay no he's playing uh he's playing that okay that's fine so that's cool uh let's see does he have the double earth no it doesn't look like he does what does the fire one do okay this just adds a non-fire so that's fine but yeah so this is it's just okay this is okay we have the storming down here hopefully he man I, if he attacks with this this is gonna hurt oh fuck well i have to storm it huh yeah, i have to storm it folks there's really nothing else i can do about it i have to storm it. um sadly but i do have to storm it to put it back in his hand hopefully he doesn't have too much to do but yeah so um all right here we go so we can just start off with this i believe right this manages correct um, okay yeah so I can just banish the, uh, the diagram which is all right with me and um, wait, banish a monster oh that sucks that's some bullshit right there but that's fine it's okay we can hit him with 32 and we get the double search next turn so that's fine um, but yeah, this is my first time playing Fire King, so if I, if I do fuck up, hey, it's not it's not really my fault. Um, this is the uh, once one, once again the Wayne McFadden deck. We're definitely gonna get the Fire King Island right here. Um, and then we're gonna we have to. Um, but uh, yeah, this is the Wayne McFadden's Fire King deck. So shout outs to him. I'll definitely link him in the description because this is his deck and stuff like that um we don't play any other uh other but pretty much all play just fires and stuff like that um well he does pretty much the same exact play that's fine but yeah so really uh <laughs> really don't know what to say but yeah man uh first time playing fire kings wow I just repeated the same thing for the first two minutes of the video but yeah, man, while, while he's doing his thing, I would like to say, if you guys do enjoy this video, leave a like, leave a comment, and also subscribe if you have not already. And if you guys can, click on that to help support the channel. Okay, so he's going into that. I'm pretty sure he's going to banish my Garunix because he feels like that's just cool. You know what? And that's that's fine. He can banish my Garunix. It doesn't look like he has too much to even do. There's the diagram. What is he going to do with the diagram? He's already triggered that, so that's not going to do anything, I believe. And yeah, I'm just going to be getting hit with 29. So, I guess next turn what we can do is definitely Onslaught. Then use the Fire King Island? Um, now that's, that's a good draw. Um, hmm. I don't think I'm going to be able to get over... Actually, I can, huh? Because I can just destroy this to search a Fire King, correct? I can destroy this to search the four. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly what I can do. So let's go ahead and onslaught first. Yeah, I can get a four with this. Let's go ahead and get Yaksha. I don't believe Yaksha is the greatest card to have. I may be mistaken. Um, as of right now, I mean, Yaksha is not too cool. I'm gonna destroy this. I'm going to add, uh, what do you do? Uh, the expression this card from hand. If this card is destroyed, it's a graveyard, it's a fire, it's a fire. Uh, I guess we can get another Yaksha for right now. Okay, we can get another Yaksha for right now. And then what we can do is normal summon and go into... You can't get Castell this back. And then proceed to hit for 2,000. What do you do? Once you turn, you can attach it. Tiger will once banish it into your next standby phase. My opponent's next standby phase because that's going to back. And then makes this gain 300 so I can hit it with 2700 I could dark rebellion and hit him with 2500 I can do this to get a to get a what's the name 
Do I play? I think he plays Wolf Bark in here. Oh, wait. I don't know if he plays Wolf Bark because we can do a real good play. Oh, shit. I don't know if he plays Wolf Bark. I forgot. I don't think he does play Wolf Bark. I may be mistaken. I don't know. I, I, uh, damn. Well, fuck. I, I think that is the best way because that is coming back. Yeah, we might as well just set up our resources. We might as well set up our resources because we are getting, uh, we are getting, um, what's the name back. So that's, that's cool. We are going to be getting the Garunix back. And Garunix. Okay, yeah, he does not play Wolf Park. All right, so we can get this. We can get the Barong, right? And then, yeah, already, what's the name? Uh, we can just normal summon this. We use this effect, right? We can at least negate everything on the board? No, just monsters. Okay, so, yeah, that's that. That's not really a problem. So right now, we can do is just get this back. Blow the board. Um, we can go ahead and blow the board. And so next turn, we can definitely get, uh... We can get a Bawesson search, a Barong search, and then we can we do a lot of things, actually. With this Barong search coming back next turn, we can get a Circle of the Fire Kings. We can grab the one that negates effects and then special summons from the graveyard. We can do we can do a whole bunch with this. I feel like we have a good we have a good decent board. Because even if this gets Oh, it does not you're gonna Okay, so the, that's just complete. So that's game flow. All right, so we started off with a victory. And that's just pretty good. We're definitely going to get this circle of fire king because I believe once this dies, right, it gets something, correct? All right, doesn't it get something? Yeah, see, I can target a fire beast in my graveyard and it comes right back. So, yeah, he's not going to be able to stop anything. I'm surprised he didn't, he wasn't able to stop anything that's going on here. Um, I can actually get this back, which is just... Which is just stupid. And it's at 3,200 because of this, I believe. And then this is going to get back getting me this. And then, like, li literally, does it get banished during the invades? Destroys it? Jesus, Ganesha is ridiculous. Ganesha is fucking ridiculous. So there we go. First, the first duel we did, start off with a great win. That was pretty easy. And all right, here we go, going up against Masiel. Masiel, let's see what we can do against him. Uh, and we look like we lost a rock, paper, scissors, and we got, uh, what's the name? We, we got probably like, I think a week, le yeah, starts on the 21st. Um, this hand is pretty good. Actually, this is really good, actually, to be honest with you. Because this negates effects, correct? And then I can destroy a card in my hand, which I, wait, did this say destroy a card in the hand or destroy, okay, yeah, destroy a fire monster. So that's cool. We can definitely negate an effect. We can definitely destroy some back row. I'm feeling pretty good about all this. Um, but yeah, man, we next on the 21st. Links, uh, links is starting. Um, do I? Yeah, I think I do. Yeah, I'm, I'm not. Even, I'm not gonna even give you the option of whooping my ass with DDDs, man. But yeah, man, we got the to the 21st. I mean, then link form. Link format is uh, not, not, link monsters are initiated. The master rule is officially begun. Um, and then, like, yeah, I hope that uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro fix, I mean, figure something out. Hope they up. I hope they uh, put a link thing on here so we'd we be good. But um, man, ooh, now that's really good. Uh, hmm, I can see. I can just bring it back. Um, no, it's no point to do that. Um, no point to negate. Um, no. Oh, wait. We could have did that. That was a fucking mistake. We... No, we don't need to do that. So what we can do here is just attack. Wait, I, I think I could have done a lot more damage. Um, yeah, we possibly could have done a lot more damage here. Uh, let me see. Because if I, if I, no, if I negated that... No, see, that, that would have been the same in my... Actually, it would have been a lot more. Because if I would have negated that, but I would have to destroy this. Actually, I could have destroyed Garunix. Then I could have normal summoned. Synchro... I mean, not synchro. Exceed into what's the name. 
Uh, get the Tinky. Um, yeah, da, 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 da. It, it was okay. I was gonna be doing some uh, some off the wall shit, but thanks to Circle of the Fire Kings, we're gonna do an extra eighteen hundred. Put him down to the smallest amount of life, which is seventeen hundred. And then next turn we get a search, so that's fine. What we can do is just go ahead and search. Uh, let me see, because I feel like we're gonna get a whole shitload of stuff back. So we could definitely search. I'm gonna search Island. Really, I feel like Island is the best card in this in this deck. Is it's so this is the best card for Fire Kings. He's already had another dark contract. That's fine. Pretty much all we have to do is hit him with 700 more. Um, I'm not gonna negate the uh, what's the name? The Kepler, I believe the name is. Uh, I believe no, yeah, the number, the level one. I, I'm, I don't, I'm just not gonna negate that. Now, the Swirl Slime can possibly get negated. I don't know. You know what? Fuck it. Let's go ahead and just negate that because getting that in the graveyard starts a whole bunch of mess that does not need to be started. It gives him uh, pretty much access to the graveyard. It gives him pretty much, he gets three summons pretty much off the DD Swirl Slime. And it looks like we won because of it. But this is a match, so hopefully this man does not quit. And we do get to play a good, uh, we do, do get to play a good game. So let's see what Masial is going to do here. And yeah, man. Uh, shout outs. To, oh, and he is quitting. Wow. Wow. Quit it. Why did I say quitting? And going on undefeated with the Fire Kings. I mean, when it when it first came out, when uh when I first seen the Fire Kings introduced and people were playing with them and stuff like that, it was a little crazy. It was very crazy. So what we can do here is do you I want to destroy you though. Because I don't even care for you. Hmm. That, I don't really care for that one. Uh, let's go ahead and get the Ganesha and set the strike. Because what this does is set the it sets the tone. That's what it does. It sets the tone. So we have two negations, two effect negations. So we can destroy this and then we can send um Garunix to the graveyard. And then while sending Garunix, when this dies, this gets back Garunix and everything gets going and get started. You know what? You're getting to get it if that's a necro face. Because we're not dealing with necro face today. I play Chaos Zone Zombies. I know what's going on. Yeah, that's not happening, sir. You're getting negated. I don't even know why you even thought that that was even smooth to even do. Let's use the Kirin. Um, and let's go ahead and send the... I would, you know what? Oh! Does this... It sends any fire monster. You know... Oh, no, never mind. I was about to say, I wish they had a one that you would special summon destroy our spells and traps. But, they do. But it's not a Fire King. And we have another quit. And yeah, man, this just uh, damn, man, Dwayne, why, why you, why you do this, man? You making everybody fucking quit? Everybody's quitting. Cause they getting beasted and feasted. Now that's a, this is a fantastic hand. Sadly, we have to destroy a monster, right? Yeah, that sucks. Um, I think I set the strike in this because yeah, see, wait, this destroys, correct? So I can Fire King Island destroy this, right? And then add the Barong and then get it destroyed. And I think that's what we're gonna do here. If I'm not mistaken, that that's that's how it should work. That's how it should work. This should attempt to destroy a card in my hand. Yes, it does. And we're gonna destroy the Barong. That's exactly what we're gonna do. And we're gonna set this. Um, I think I'm gonna keep the twin twister because um, there's just just for a monetary reason I'm just fine. but uh, yeah we're gonna just definitely keep the twin twister in hand and right here since we already have the onslaught we're definitely gonna search the fire king let me the circle because things can get really out of hand with this card and especially with Ganesha these cards get out of hand and I have a fire king island so we can definitely do a bunch of shit that we're not supposed to do. All right, so it looks like we might be playing the same exact player. Are you gonna at least summon a monster? Is you are you playing Metaphys? Because he's playing. Yeah, hey, he is playing some Metaphys. Uh, you know what? I'm going to. What does this one do? Oh, wait a minute. No. Oh wait. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, you know what? I. Let me see. All right. So wait, what does this one do? Let's see. What does this do? Um, when this card is banished, shuffle and wait, what? 
Okay, so that's already happening. You know what? Since I do need a monster on the board, I'm, I'm gonna just have to let him do this. I'm gonna have to let him get his shit off. That's what sucks. Oh, I didn't want to. So what did this do? Once you turn this card, wait, what? You vanish all set? Oh, all set spell and trap cards on the field. Um, okay. I don't think he thought that one through. Oh yeah, I take 24. And I can possibly put a I can possibly put damage game on board. Yeah, I don't think he's I don't think he thought that one through. I don't I don't even think he realized that that that, that. Ah, that does that. So what I can do here is onslaught for the Ganesha. I can use Island to pop the Ganesha. And wait, what one of them special summons from my hand, right? Does this do it? No, they, they spell someone when they get destroyed. Okay. Um, hmm. And you know what? I think I'm just going to have to go west and eight. No. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know, what I'm, I know what I'm doing. Okay, I know what I'm doing here. Oops. So let's do this. And uh, what we're going to get established is Garunix, right? Because what we can do here is that we could uh, pop with this um, and then get Ganesha back. Can pop with this. Pop you. Go ahead and grab Ganesha. And um, what we can do here is normal summon this guy. We can activate the Circle of the Fire King. Uh, we can go. It doesn't really matter. Pop that. Special that. Then Ganesha triggers. Getting us back to Barong here. Bam. And then what we can do here is we can definitely go Bujin Kajasuchi and I think that's really what we might be doing here because with that then I can protect myself no all right no I don't even want to do that I wanted to do Tiger King but fuck it this is all right with me really did I really just mill five spells and traps well you know what that's fine with me. what we can do here is um we can attack you I feel like you do something when you're in the graveyard I think something can happen. Um, let's go ahead and put that. Uh, and let's go ahead and set. Let's go ahead and set two. Yeah, let's go ahead and set two just to scare him. Oh, I forgot that dies at the end of the phase. All right, so I was smart in doing what I did. Uh, let me see. What I don't even know what that one does. So we're gonna just allow that to happen. Cause I, I literally don't know what any of that does. Um, I think that may that may special something. Wait, why the fuck? Okay, it adds. Why the hell would you banish that? Like, that literally does nothing to get it back. Um, let's go ahead and summon the Grunix. And this is the reason why, you know, I felt like Kajasuchi was better. Because of we can protect it when the Grunix comes back. Even if we fall victim to, like, a Dark Hole or something. If he tries a Dark Hole, I mean, each turn. Okay, that's fine. Oh, shit. That motherfucker is beefy. Um, it's probably, oh, why would you attack the Garunix? Okay, that's fine with me. Tri uh, use this Garunix, and we're definitely going to get a, a Ganesha back. And this Banish, and then you special summon a fire. Okay, well, that's fine with me. What's going on? Why did this not Banish? Am I missing something? Um, but if you do, oh, during the end phase of the next turn. Okay, so we can definitely just Twin Twister here. That would have really been a problem just now. I just noticed what that shit said at the back. That shit says I cannot respond to the activation of Metaphys cards. Okay, that doesn't do anything now. If you had that turn one, then you would have been good. So let's go ahead and use you. Pop this. Um, and here we could search. Let's search another one. This is only once per turn, correct? Yeah, it's only once per turn. Uh, let's see. What what do we want to add? It really doesn't matter. Let's go ahead and get Yaksha. Let's tribute, I mean, activate the Ganesha to go ahead and get you back. Um, and then, yeah, I guess we could just special summon this. There's no reason not to. Now, now it protects us from the normal summon. See, if this we had Coach Soldier Wolf Bart, we would have actually had a game. Because we can go, uh, let's go and get the Tinky search. And then bam, bam, bam. But we don't have that, so we can't use it. Um, but we can go this. 
No, we'll see. We don't think that's too stupid. We can Dark Rebellion. And I think that's, that's that's just a good thing to do. We can definitely Dark Rebellion. Um, and just have monstrous attack. How much attack is it? Woo, 39 fucking 50. Isn't, isn't that just good? So right now, if he does honest, he's still he's actually going to be an equal attack with my Dark Rebellion. So we'll still be able to get rid of it. Now he's down to 26. Let's see what he can actually do because we do still have this strike left. Um, okay, well, you know what? I don't care. You can, you can do that all you want. That's, that's fine with me. Okay, well, there we go. Once again, another win. Jesus, be right back. And alrighty, here we go against Aaron Hold 3. And let's see what we can do. We have won the die roll and we have opened up completely. Oh man, this one card off from doing some real good damage. But we can't. We sadly have to end our turn. If we just hit double Boron, that shit would have been so good. Uh, Alright, there's a D draw. Looks like they we're going up against some Destiny Heroes or maybe. We, oh, I think this, yep, we're going to get some type of turbo deck, some draw turbo deck. But what is he actually going to go for? Is it Exodia? Is it literally just a Destiny Hero? No, it looks like trade in is maybe hitting, the, the, maybe hitting the field a little, uh, Dinko fucking Seca. Jesus Christ. What is going on? Okay. Farmerization. Do not have the Mally. Do not have the Mally. And I know what I, I know, folks. I know. Because as soon as I say don't have the Mally, they always have the Mally. And then it ends up just being bad for us. I don't know. It just... <laughs> it ends up just being bad for us. Oh, he has double Mally. That is sickening. If he does not have the third one in his hand, I, I would say he probably has the third one in his hand. My Oh, Aaron, I, I feel bad for you. I feel real bad. I hope that we do draw... I hope we do draw a what's the name? Any fire. We, we, we draw a double barong. That's just that's just cool. That's just cool if we can draw a double another barong. Anything would be really good. Um craft would be a okay, but that that's even better. That's even better. Because now we can get double barong going. We can possibly we can possibly get I don't know if we can get game, but we could definitely do we can do a bunch. See what I can do here. Is this 200 defense also? Yes, it is. Hmm. What I can do here is special summon this, Tenzu this, right? Then, uh, okay, yeah, I know what I'm doing here. All right, watch this, folks. Watch this, folks. Have I've never played Fire Kings before, but you guys are finna see. Okay, I, I was trying to trigger it. Um, you guys are finna see some uh, amazing things right now. So here, what we can do, oh, we're supposed to go team right? Oh, wait, I fucked complete, no, I didn't, no, I didn't, did I? Okay, see, I have things in my mind, but I don't think that's going to work, folks. Um, see, here, I was going to go, I was trying to go Tiger King, right? To so go ahead and get us the Tinky so we can get an extra, what's the name, get an extra search. And then I was supposed to have it two cards in the graveyard somehow. Okay, I'm trying to figure out how to do it. I can go Dark Rebellion and not go Rekindle. That's what I can do. But let's just do this right now. Because I feel like um no, we're not gonna we're not gonna do that. Um yes, I wanna banish a monster. We're gonna banish this guy. Um no need to use Ganesha for right now. We just have this rekindling. And we just get two of these back, so now we can do massive amount of damage. Okay, see, this is where I completely fucked up. This is where I fucked up, folks. I fucked up badly. Because what was supposed to happen <laughs> was not this. This was not supposed to happen. Um, I had a whole totally different plan. Um, I should have did my first thing, which was the Rebellion. Uh, I was supposed to rebellion, then rekindle, attack, 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 and then fire king, so I can get both of these in the graveyard with their effects. But you know what? It's okay. I feel like we ended up with a decent board, anyways. I feel like we ended up pretty good. Um, so let's go ahead and get the tinky real quick, and then with the tinky, um, 
with the Tinky, we can go ahead and, yes, yeah, so we're gonna add, we can add Ganesha, because I believe this is another fire monster I control. So I can just scare him off with this, even though I do have the, uh, what's the name down there? I could scare him off with the, uh, with this. This is the extra negator. This is the extra negator. So we, we, we're we good. I feel like we're, we're in decent, we're in decent, um, what's the name? We're in decent territory right now. Uh, we're in real decent territory right now. So let's see what we can do here. Let's see how we can finish this off. Oh, he probably has the third, what's the name? He probably has the third Mally in his hand. Oh, he does. I think he does. Well, you know what? I believe that's it. So let's go ahead and go to the deck profile. All right. So he here is the deck profile. Once again, this is Dwayne McFadden's Fire Kings. And we went undefeated today. Blew away the competition. Only thing I would add is, like I said, the Wolf Barks would, would have made some of these plays just out of, out of this world. What I would take out for possibly the Wolf Bark is this, the Kieran, and one of these. And just add like two wolf barks or just try to fit three wolf barks in. Uh, I mean, however you do it. But yeah, wolf bark in this deck, oh my god, is, is it would be crazy because of this. You can do so many level four plays, it's not even funny. But like I said, I can't complain. We did go undefeated. And I'm not complaining because we did go undefeated. So thanks once again to Dwayne McFadden. Link isn't the link to his channel is in the description below. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy it. And I will see you guys.